Hello and welcome to this game between Sky Marshals and Eventuality on Dry Dog. This is for the New Bloods tournament. Uh, your caster today is Only Logic, and with you today is Pyron Zero. I'm here. What's happening, guys? So we've got this game between Sky Marshals Tribe and uh, Eventuality. Two uh, fairly good clans for the uh, Oceania Seven v Sevens ladder. Eventuality has actually been climbing up the ladder a lot, haven't they? Although it looks like uh, Sky Marshal's Tribe is the better team here, but let's see how it goes. Let's introduce the teams. On Sky Marshal's Tribes, we've got Darth Benedict, Dark Wolf, Sky Marshal Hef, Gaz, Skadoosh, Orkarai, and Acedia. And on Diamond Sword, we've got Eridicus, uh, Oms, which I think was Omino before, Barrow Hand. Blue Sky, Rifter, Jeevos, and Baby Monkey, which is a relatively new addition to the uh, Eventuality Clan. Yeah. It doesn't really look like uh, Baby Monkey is going to be capping for the team today, as he was against the game with this three dudes. An interesting question. Let's find out who the capper is. And there's Omino's. He's just taken the flag, but he's not too fast out. I mean, he is out because of that offense. Yeah, but he's out and he's been sniped by Darth Benedict. That is going to be an, uh, an interesting point there. Darth Benedict is going to be the clutch player of the team there. Yeah, Darth Benedict is going to run fast. I wonder if he'd have a. Uh... Oh, that was the first cap there. Oh, that was the first cap to Sky Marshal's tribe. I'm oh, sorry, I've missed that. And it looks like the uh, that is going to be the second cap, unless there's a return there. Omino has gone in for the uh, e grab, and it looks like that flag has been returned. Looks like the uh, Diamond Sword Generator is down already, whereas the Blood Eagle Generator uh, isn't. Let me point out that there is also no designated Infiltrator on Eventuality to take care of uh, Darth Benedict. Do you think that's a wise move, Pyron? Um, not entirely. Like, you know, we've seen this before, how you know, shut down the camp. You know, it's still not to shut the camp, so... And And if we look at Blue Sky here, he was just sniped a few times by Darth Benedict. That gives you an idea of his skill. He's, pretty He's more happy to snipe the cap on the other side. That was a cap uh, to eventuality there. So it is now one all on Dry Dock for this New Bloods tournament. Let's take a look at Omino here that's uh, gone the high route, although Darth Benedict has already oh, spotted it. Coming in now for that uh, sort of back to front map there as the shadow of the ship lures over the base here. And there he goes. Rifter is out with the flag, probably uh, not so much an E rather than uh, just a grab. Gaz on the other team is out with the uh, uh, eventuality flag and they're meeting each other in the midfield but Gaz is well out. Looks like he's, a, he's got no defense at the base to uh, help him out there. Yeah, and then they all come. Yeah, it looks like this may be the first standoff situation we might have here. Oh, right. Rift has got the flag and he's got some support from Eridicus and Baby Monkey there. Meanwhile, there's uh, the Sky Marshal's tribe has the eventuality flag as well and, and has a lot of support. Let's take a look at what Darth Benedict sees. What Darth Benedict sees is uh, might be a little bit better. He ha Oh, he looks like he's got a Pathfinder skin there, doesn't he? I have no idea what's coming to work. Okay. Nah, there you go. Let me just unlock that and take a quick look at that. That does look like a skin glitch. Pathfinder with a phaser rifle. There you go. Let's take a quick look at where the flags are. Jeevos has come in. He's taken a few shots at the CDR. He hasn't got very far. Meanwhile, on the other side of the base, that was has been a retrieve, and that's a cap to Sky Marshal's tribe 2-1. Well, this is certainly very interesting. Uh, Gazza is coming in from Sky Marshal's tribe already. G-Boss has sit. Oh, no, he hasn't, but he's missed the flag. Oh, 
and I'm taking I'm taking a look for Omino. He's coming in on the high. He's not going very fast. Do you think he's going to set up for a static here? Uh, well, he's going to be careful about uh, Darth Benedict. Let's take a look at Darth Benedict. He is on the other hill, but he, he looks around. And he's getting up to the uh, optimal sniping spot on this part of the map, I presume. You're a sniper for biohazard, uh, Fire and Zero. What do you think of uh, Darth Benedict's sniping tactics? Uh, uh, oh, Barrowhand has just taken a shot while Gaz has gone out with a flag. Meanwhile, Omino has also... Oh, not gone out. He has been chased down. It looks like they are going to cluster it. Can Orcry get the retrieve? No, he can't. Baby Monkey now has the flag. On the other side, Gaz has got a lot of support. He's got G-Boss taking shots at him. But it looks like G-Boss might be taken out relatively quickly. There he is. Now we've got our second standoff situation here. Baby Monkey, Rifter, and Eridicus are holding this flag here. And some nice little passing there. And there's Omino, the Pathfinder. He's probably coming in. He doesn't want to be coming in alone, though. Gvos is looking like he's about to support him. Well, that's been returned. Oh, and the seed here has, has capped the flag. That's three oh, wow. wild Sky Marshals. We need to be checking out what's happening with that Sky Marshals offense because that is very good. Now let's see, we've got uh, Omino setting up for a uh, loader high. Although, once again, he is going rather slowly. I'm not sure whether he's just getting into position to try and avoid Dark Benedict Snipes. Not that it's been held. We've got Gazza on a much faster loader high here. Let's take a look at the offense. Skadoosh is there going for the sniper, I presume? No, I don't think he can find the sniper. Either way, there's Dark Wolf and uh, Sky Marshal Heft. Sniper's up on the hill there. That stand looks completely open. Gazza's, what, five seconds out. Omino's getting in the way. No, he's grabbed it. He's almost full health. Snipe once. Will Blue Sky be able to snipe him out? Yes, he will. Meanwhile, the flag here... Omino's flag that was grabbed now has been returned, and both of the flags have been returned. Bit of a duel here between Acedia and uh, Gvos. Neither of them are really letting it go. Oh, he sniped out. Let's see if we can find some cappers. We've got uh, Oms getting ready for that uh, that path there, which is rather slow. I can't, I can't say that I can really um, explain what's happening there. He has been spotted by Darth, and he will be sniped out. I think he's manually trying to stay there, so he wouldn't be spotted by Darth, but it's just by him. It doesn't look like it is working. It looks like they are going to have to get on Darth early, and they're, they're going to have to have an infiltrator, or a pathfinder, or a soldier. He's just getting the free shots, and it's really hard. What about that... Uh, oh, Gaz is out with the flag again. He's got to chase a G-Boss who misses his first Nitron. Gaz flies up for the second Nitron. Is he going to be sniped? He's turned in. He is sniped. This looks like it's not helping. Will Riffler be able to E? No, he won't. And that's a chain grab by Skadoosh. Blue Sky has taken him out, but Dark Wolf is still there to receive that flag, but it looks like it's going to be a return. No! Dark Wolf has picked it up from under their hands and he's punted it upwards. Gaz hasn't tried to get in position, and that's a return. Eridicus has the flag. It has been returned. Sky Marshal Hef is on him. He's on 20 health. Sky oh, Sky Marshal Hef is down, but Acedia has the E-grab there. Very good timing. Skadoosh might have this return. That's the return. Acedia has that flag. Will he be able to run it? He does punt it. But he punts it to nobody, unfortunately. Looks like that's another reset. Oh, no, Baby Monkey has the flag. He's really walking it. He's probably gonna he's probably gonna try and force a return. Yeah, he's thrown it onto the flag stand there. But I don't think Orkrai is gonna accept that. He is definitely gonna throw it right up next to the wall. No, Eridicus has the flag and he's grabbed it from under their noses.
going at a brisk 150 though. Punts himself off. Darth is missing these shots. Oh, he's being tagged by a Cedia there. Meanwhile, on the other flag, the other flag has been taken by who? Who was it taken by? It's taken by Orcrai, who's brute holding it. Is that going to be a return there by Barrowhand? Yes, it's a return there. The other flag is going to be returned by Sky Marshal Hef. No. Maybe Monkey has picked up the flag. It's three on one against Sky Marshal Hef. He's doing a very good job of it. He's down. Can they get this? Can Gaz get in for the E before Baby Monkey caps it? Oh, but yeah. no, he can't. And that's a reset. Barrowhound. Sorry about that. Yeah, Omino is casting that Nitron way too late and is running into that creativity wall, and that's probably what's causing him to slow down so much. Doesn't matter how low he is, Darth is spotting him and he is tagging him. I was going to say, actually, Darth is making him slow down, so he's sort of... Yeah. But yeah, yeah creativity wall is quite bad. Blue Sky is shooting Gaz, but I think you can. I think that's when you can see the difference between a sniper like Darth Benedict and a sniper like Blue Sky. Either way, he has spotted him, so the defense will be aware that he is coming for that Darth back low to high. Dark Wolf is really getting in there and causing some havoc, so is Sky Marshal Hef. And that flag stand looks fairly open. Oh, oh can he take it? He does take it. Gaza is out with that flag. He is being sniped, but Blue Sky's missing, unfortunately. Where's the Kappa for uh, eventuality? It's a Riddicus. I think it's a Riddicus there, but he has been spotted. And there's nobody on the stand there, so he probably... Whoa. Out with it. I was about to say too soon when I said he wasn't going to get out with it, but he is being sniped and he is being shot. And there's n nobody there to support him either. Uh, you being a sniper, what do you think about this uh, potential nerf to the uh, sniping guns, the plasma gun and the sap 20, was it? The plasma gun? <laughs> Sorry, not the, phase, the phase, phase gun, the phase rifle. Uh, what do you think of the uh, potential, quote, nerf of it? Yeah. Yeah, I don't. I don't think we're really noticing it much in this game because the damage wasn't actually reduced. This was just the time of it. <clears throat> yeah, definitely. I think that um, definitely makes sense, especially with that pre-shot. Uh, Gaz is out with a flag, by the way, and he is being sniped. He's gotten one snipe, two snipes on him. But Omino... Oh, baby monkey goes in for the E-grab. Nearly. And who's got the strike up? Let's see who's got the strike up. That is Sky Marshal Hef with the strike there, and he is going to chase baby monkey down. He is shot down by Dark Wolf prior, though, and Dark Wolf gets the return, and that is the six cap to Sky Marshal's tribe. We are on dry dock. What a game. It's been pretty entertaining so far. It's all kind of crazy shit. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, didn't they? Did they mention something about uh, getting Darth Benedict to cap? That would be interesting. But I'm sure that they mentioned something along those lines. Let's take a look at where the cappers are. Gaz is just coming up the hill on this uh, high to low here. This is actually a route I'm not too familiar with. Oh, he just catches that hill there, and he comes straight down into the flag. Uh, that <laughs> that flag stand is dominated. It's just G-Boss there, and he won't get in time. Gaz is out with that flag. Let's look at the defense for the uh, Sky Marshal's tribe. Rifter is there just uh, throwing it on, but Acedia has held them both off. That looks like the seventh. That is the seventh okay. cap. That was a good game, well, really quick game there to uh, Sky Marshal's Tribe, capping out 7-2 on Dry Dock. Let's take a look at some of the scores for these players. We've got uh, Baby Monkey was really pulling up, uh, getting some E caps there, E grabs there, and uh, helping out the team there, coming in first with Blue Sky the Sniper, which is usually not surprising. Not really. Guys, yeah, if Darth Benedict getting the most kills on the Blood Eagle side, once again. Not really surprising. Uh, so that was a very good game. Well done to Darth Benedict there on the, on the uh, killing spree. And the rampage. But I think we do have to point out that it's very important that they do uh, decide to uh, 
get on uh, Darth Benedict. Otherwise, that's what's going to happen. He is just going to dominate both the offense and the Kappas, and they won't be able to do any Kappas. Yeah, they will be really hard that Kappa tends that game, and it's definitely showing up on the scoreboard. Yeah, definitely. So we don't need to do something about it. But I wonder if we're going to see dual Kappa next game. Possibly, we could see dual capping with Baby Monkey and Omino. That was the strategy that they ran against uh, Star. Yeah, it really, really worked well. Well, we're going to cut out, and we're going to come back to you in just a moment after a quick tech check. <laughs> 